grew up here. I started in corrections and uh, came out here to the road. I want to stay in my, in my area here, um, close to where I live, watch my kids grow up and make sure that I can kind of help out but dampen whatever. the crime out here as much as I can. Maybe in the future they have physical slash verbal fight. Don't know any more on that. We're gonna go check it out. What's going on? Listen, relax for a second. I need to figure out what's going on. I have artificial joints. Look at my... All right, listen, you got to stop for a second so we understand what's going on. And why are we here? Because she took off. All I want is my phone so I can call my mom. Tell me to send me a ticket to go home. I can't, I can't deal with this no more. She beat her dad up yesterday. Hey, stand here for a second, okay? Take a breath. Relax. Stand right here. We're going to talk to you. Who's that, your daughter? And what's her yeah. name? It's Erica, but she's okay. going to tell you nothing. Erica. Get her away from that stay. car because stay. they were there last right. night and they will Can you, can you back, Please, back up and stop? Please, they will back lie Back up and stop. They Relax. They will lie for her. Erica. Why? All right, what we got going on here? Erica, how old are you? I am 16. Yeah, okay, where do you live? Over there. And where does your mother live full time? With me. Okay, she says she needs a bus ticket. What's going on? No, yesterday, her and my dad got into a fight over my brother coming to live with us. She tore up my house. She beat the crap out of him. And then today, when I told her that he said he wasn't sorry and that he wanted divorce and wanted her out of his house, she freaked out and threw his clothes in the canal. So I called my grandma, and then that made her more mad. And she, she tried to lock me out of the house, so I crawled through my window and when I got through my window, she tried to rip my stereo out of my room. She threw a tree at me. She threw my tree at me. She picked up my computer monitor and threw it at me. And when I tried to get past her, she tried to grab me. So I spun around and she rolled off my bed and hit her face on my wall. And now she's trying to say that I hit her. Was anyone else in the house? No. Where's your dad at? He's on his way home. Okay, stop. You need to relax. <laughs> you, st he... you stop. Right now, I need all your cooperation. Come back here. He doesn't even know what's going on, and my phone is dead. Sit right there, and let me go talk to these people. Hi, ma'am. How are you? Um, I hear that you got a lot going on here in neighborhood drama. <laughs> they came to your house, sir. Um, excuse no. me. Weird. Okay. Um, you were inside, and they came, knocked inside. on the door. My husband was like, honey, and I look out my window, and that truck tried to run that young lady over. And she, we came out the door because we didn't know who they were, and all of a sudden, she's like, my mother's trying to run me over with the car. She gets out of the car. She's waiting. She's all swollen. She threw the phone at her mom. Okay. Um, I'm assuming that's her mom. Yeah. And then she also stated that the bump she has on the side of her face supposedly happened last night. It's not my judgment call. Yeah. Okay. All I know is that when they run up on your yard... Yes, I understand. Like, well, give me a couple of minutes and then I'll get you taken care of. Oh, of course. Yeah, take it inside. And from there on, I won't, I won't need anything else. So I appreciate it. I'm going to try to get the drama moved back to their house so we can... Yeah, they said they live close, so... Thank you so much. Welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. What took place out here? Did she try to run you over with her vehicle? Yes, she did, officer. I had to run through all of that and all of that. And when I ran through there, some people seen me and I said, can you please call the cops? She's trying to run me over. Okay. I'm scared for my life. She pulled up right here because I was sitting in this driveway waiting for my friend. And she's like, you give me my phone or I'm going to smash your camera. And I'm like, mom, please just leave me alone. Okay. Please get away from me. Now, did she hit you at all? She I noticed my hair. She scratched my neck. I see the scratch on your neck. <laughs> Listen, we're going to go back to your house, figure out what's going on, okay? What's happened out here? I don't know. This was a Sunday before I left. <laughs> So she took the screen out, the screen was in. No, my screen I had took out because she locked me out and I was just gonna go in my room and get my phone charger and some clothes so I could leave for the night. Okay. Alright. 
So, from what I can see, there was something pretty rough here to happen. I mean, there's stuff throwing everywhere. There's stuff from out our window. And why? Bought it all. So, you, you took the screen out and no, threw it all? The screen was already out? Yeah. And then you just went ahead and threw everything out? That's right. I did. Okay. I bought it. She shouldn't have nothing but a mattress on that floor the way that she treats us. Okay. Her dad left out last night. I don't know if he was drinking when he got home. He destroyed his room. I cleaned my whole house, put all his stuff in his room. They're both bipolar. He drinks. He won't let her take medicine. Okay. Uh, can I ask you a question? <laughs> yeah. What happened down there? Because there's tire marks everywhere. Because she was running from me. With, I just want my phone to call my mom. Okay, so you're t attempting it, to get the, it, get the phone? She, I, as soon as I would stop her, she'd run to another okay but, I, I would never hurt my daughter but with the vehicle what where does that i mean i don't, I don't understand i can't run i got this in my back or i got a you didn't think about calling us she's got my phone there's no home phone no all right right now you're going to be detained in the back of our car until detectives come was it going to hit her all right. i just wanted her to stop go ahead and get a drink of water you can bring that in for right now until they get here, they're going to come sort this out. Someone's going to jail. Just let them figure it out. 132 in Bush. I got him at gunpoint. Okay, gunpoint 132 in Bush. Coverage. Viewer discretion is advised.